Hi everybody and welcome back to the channel. Today we are going to be doing a little Timu haul. And yes, I looked it up and it's pronounced Timu. Thank you for y'all that also let me know that. We have this right here. And on this haul I have 43 items and total spent was $42.54. So that comes out to a little bit under a dollar an item. And before we get started, I did want to let you know a little bit more about what's, you know, what's Timu, where'd they come from? So Timu is a subsidiary of PDD Holdings Inc. They have like the counterpart of like Timu counterpart in China as well. However, Timu is supposed to be headquartered in Boston. Basically what they did is that they cut out the middleman, um, allowing the Chinese vendors to sell the products directly to the US consumers and shipping directly from China. So instead of having warehouses in the US, they are shipping directly from there, which is pretty awesome because their shipping doesn't take that long. Another company that's very similar is AliExpress. Yet with AliExpress, shipping can take a while. I find that interesting that they're saying they're cutting out the middleman and the vendors can ship directly, yet everything arrives in one package. Timu was started in September 2022. And for all our Canadians, they started doing business and being able to ship to Canada this month, February 2023. So if you haven't signed up, make sure to use my code. I'll put it right here and you can get 30% off your first order. Okay. So just make sure to use that code and you'll get that 30% off. So on with the show, let me get these items out. I'm going to try to organize them in again, themed piles. So this time around, I think I focused a little bit more on jewelry. I think that's this order. I have another order coming in actually later today. Um, but I think this one is the one I focused a little bit more in jewelry. So let's take a look and see what wonderful pieces I got for less than a dollar each. Okay, so it looks like we have four distinct themes this time around. It's a tiny amount for kitchen some items for personal care or accessories uh, that are non-jewelry. Then we have jewelry, a tiny bit of stationery, and some um, jewelry making. So those are the piles we have. So let's start with kitchen. Let's see. So first thing I got is this ladle. So it's really cool because you can and then sometimes when you know when you don't want so much of the liquid <laughs> like you can just use this side to you know empty out as much of the liquid as you want to get rid of so this one was 69 cents and I really liked the color look at that good size so I thought this was great and it's great material. It's not like cheap, it's good. The next thing I have is this lease separator. I got it for 69 cents. And so this is, you see the different size little holes. So when you want to separate, let's say your cilantro leaves from the little stem, you push it through depending on the size you, and you just pull it through. And on the other side, it will leave, you know, all the leaves. So that's really cool. And then you can also use this portion right here to like chop. So you can hold it and then chop your, you know, your leaves. Like um, also rosemary. Rosemary is a really good one. You put it through the little hole, you pull the little stalk through, and all you have is your little rosemary leaves. So this is a cool one. I've been wanting something like it and for 69 cents and very good, like solid material. So I recommend this one. This one's awesome. And for all you avocado lovers, 
I love, 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 love avocado. Um, I saw this little gadget. It, I got it for 69 cents. And it's the, uh, it's used for the avocado. So you use this side to cut the avocado. Like you cut it in half. And then the little half, you use this side to just go in and scoop it. And as you're doing it, it does the slicing for you and it separates it from the peel. So I haven't tried one of these out. We'll check, I'll check it out. And like this side you can use for other types of fruits just to take off like the little stems of the strawberries and all that. So it's a multi-use. I'm gonna try this out and see if it really saves me some time or some yuckiness. <laughs> Um, and the last thing I got that is kitchen, which I'm super excited about, um, this one did, did cost $2.08. And these are silicone covers for your bowls. Here they are. It was $2.08 because I have a set of three, I mean of six. This is a set of six. So what you do is you stretch this out to cover your bowl. So this is a small one and this is the largest one and it has a smiley face. So you can use this to cover like plates, bowls, that kind of stuff. And because of the material, it sticks. So I was really excited for these because I don't know if it's happened to you, but somehow you end up misplacing a bowl. It. I don't know what happens. You know, then you have a bunch of bowls like Tupperware type and you don't have a lid for them. So I bought these to see if they would work with those items because I, you know, and some bowls just don't come with a lid, but they are good size and you wish you had a lid. So I'm going to try these out, see how they work and maybe I have a solution. And for $2.08 for a set of six, that's pretty neat. If they work out, then I'll probably get another set because they don't take up much room. Like you can literally fold them and put them in a drawer or something like flat or folded. So that's really neat. So the next thing is different accessories, personal care type of thing. I hadn't really delved into much of it. So first things first, this one's 75 cents and it is a scrunchie, but like a metal, what's plastic? Never mind. It's plastic and you're supposed to open and then you can create like a ponytail. Like if you pass your ponytail through there and then you close it, it's supposed to give you like a higher ponytail or you can even put it like bun style. So I would thought that was really cool. I've had like, I guess a version of this, but it was elastics and that, you know, it would be like here and then elastics, these crisscross would be elastics. And it didn't last as long because the elastics would just give out. But I like this, it opens and then you just close it. And I love the color. Again, 75 cents for this one. And then I got some nail wraps and each one of the, these was 44 cents, which is not bad for nail, nail wraps because I bought some and they are way more expensive than this. This one was just the different colors and it comes with a full set. So this can be for your right hand, left hand, that type of thing. These are the two colors I picked. This one's a little bit more like, like a darker pink and this is a brighter pink. And you just put them on, on your nails. Hopefully it fits. The biggest one is gonna be, ooh, it's gonna be really, We'll see if it fits my thumb because that's always my problem because I have bigger nail beds. So we'll see. We'll see if this one works. Uh, but for 44 cents each, I thought it was pretty cool. They had pretty colors. So I went for it. Next things I got 
uh, these were 71 cents each and they're the long lasting lip color. And this caught my attention because supposedly you put it on, let it dry, then peel it and you have like a lip stain type of thing. I got the Romantic Bear Watermelon and Cherry Red. So again, each one of these was 71 cents. I think that's what I said. So I'll try those out and take pictures and or maybe a little video, but like a short, maybe I'll make a short out of those two and post on the channel. I can tell you just right now from like taking it, like my finger stained. <laughs> So that was the lightest color. So, ooh, it might be, it might be strong, the color, very pigmented. So next thing is this little thing is 89 cents. And this, okay, don't laugh. I just had to see it. I just had to try it. It's a little thing like that. And it has little tools. This is an ear cleaning kit. Don't judge me. So it has all these little things, little tools to clean out your ears. And I mean, I think this is pretty handy. Please like, just, I'm gonna tell you right now, do not stick things all the way in your ear. This is not, that's not what this is meant for. Um, you know, if anything, I would just do like, you know, like the outside of the ear, all around here, just there. Um, just to make sure my ears are clean, but I'm not sticking these like in there. Um, some of y'all might feel comfortable doing it, or maybe you can get someone else to help you. But I mean, I don't recommend sticking stuff way in there. Even Q-tips, like you're not supposed to stick them all the way in there. But I just like this and it comes in a little handy little case so I can just store it where I have like my nail clippers and all that so thought that was neat and then we got this one for 71 cents okay so this is supposed to be the one that is like lip balm but and it's sealed okay so that's awesome but that also is supposed to change color when you put it on all I carry was that it was aloe vera stick so there's the aloe vera stick. And for me, it was just neat. Oh, that's a little bit pigmented from the other stuff because it was uh, basically like chapstick type of thing, but aloe. So I use, I use this type of stuff a lot. I also got this mask, it's 89 cents. So this is an eye mask. And it's for, you know, when you want to go to sleep and oh, there's just too much light. I like this for when I travel because when you stay at hotels, sometimes the curtains still have some space and I can still see some light. And I like, to, I like it to be pitch dark when I'm asleep. So I got this. It has some Velcro and elastic, but you just do this. Yeah. It works and it's very soft. It is a little cushiony, but it's very practical because it, I can fold it really small and there's no rough edges. There's, it's like the bra inserts. That's kind of what this feels like. Very soft, a little bit of cushion, um, but this I can throw in my luggage, no problem, you know. It doesn't have any metal or anything that would set anything off. So that's what I liked about that one. I got a little headband for 71 cents. I haven't done an actual headband in quite a while. Part of the reason is because my hair is so straight. Like this is my hair air dried, okay? I don't do anything, absolutely nothing like blow drying, nothing flat iron, nothing. My biggest issue is whenever I put something in my hair, like a clip or something that I want to be like, oh my God, that's so cute. 
it just slips off. Hair bands, same thing. But I saw this one that had the little teeth. So I'm hoping this works because then it goes in. See? And I thought that would, you know, that would keep it from just slipping off because that's my problem. Things would just slip off and I really like it and it's very comfortable. So I'm going to keep it on and see how it does. Next thing I got is in this box and it says it's 134. So let's open this one up and see what it is. If it is what it is, I think it is. I hope they're good. And yay! Sunglasses! I really needed a new pair and I just didn't want to spend a ton of money on them because we all, I, at least for me, I leave them in the car, I leave them in the office. I can't be having expensive sunglasses and me just leaving them everywhere. But these are cool. These are a nice size. Detailing on the outside. You see, oh, it has some, has a little bit of scratching there. You see that right there? Hmm, I wonder if that's gonna bother me. So let's try these out. Ooh, yes. You know what? It doesn't bother me unless I look like like my eye has to be right there. But other than that, like these are nice. I like these. Look at that. And I like for sunglasses to cover my whole eye um, because if they're a little too small, I'm like, then what's the point? They're supposed to cover your eyes to protect them. So highly recommend these. These were great. And for a dollar, what did I say? A dollar 34? Yes. Uh, I love them. I will be using them. I might go back and buy some other colors if they offer other colors. I'm not sure. All right. So that was all, like I said, like personal care or accessories that were not jewelry. Next thing I want to look at is small stuff that is stationary. I just have four items really. This is a pack of stickers, 89 cents, because you know your girl cannot get away from them stickers. Um, these are Easter themed, so I thought those were really, would be really neat. There you go. You can look at how cute those are. You know, with Easter coming up, Maybe you want to get some of these to put in the kids' baskets. Very age appropriate. There's nothing in here so far that would cause, oh, look at that one. I love those. Um, that would cause any concerns. At least I don't see, you know, anything on my end. So these would be cute. Also, you know, if you're a teacher and you want some cute stickers, I highly recommend Timu. They have a great assortment. And if you catch any of their deals, you, you save even more money. Okay, so this is another pack, 99 cents for this pack. And I think this one was plants. And that's why I was like, I have to have it. We'll see. Let's see. Yeah. Yeah, it was like plants, foliage, that type of. So this one, again, super cute. I got my sticker, <laughs> that's cute. I got my sticker fix in this order by ordering these two packs of this, you know, of this type of sticker. I have a ton of them now. I actually have to get to scrapbooking and doing all that to be able to use use them and make some space in my sticker bin. This last thing is 69 cents. And oh, I think these are another pack of stickers or are they paper? So they are like this, travel. Yeah, they're stickers. So, but this is travel related. So again, we do, like to take trips so the these 
I definitely use um, for my travel scrapbooking stuff. And if you all want me to do like videos and include some of uh, whenever we travel, just let me know if you're interested in seeing that type of content. Um, obviously that would be more like a travel vlog or something that I could do. I know we are planning a couple of trips this year already. So just let me know if that's something you're interested in and I can definitely put something together for when we travel. Um, I'm hoping we can do a lot more of it this year. And then lastly for this section, 98 cents, I got a pen. Why did I get a pen? I'm, I don't remember. What's so special about this pen? Is Oh, it's not a pen. It's not a pen. It is a utility knife that is shaped like a pen. But if you see the point, it's slanted. So you use this to really, like you really need to cut something that is very, very detailed or you need to be very careful, you use this. You gotta remember, it's not a pen. Ooh, all right. Let's move on to the jewelry. Let's get going. Uh, first things first, I ordered these for 79 cents and I think I have our, I had ordered a pair already in the previous haul, but I saw these and you can never have enough of these little ducks. Look at that. These have a golden um, colored, metal. So little ducks. Very, very cute. I love that. 79 cents. And they do come with a little metal stoppers for the fish hook earring. Super adorable. Love those. I like unique earrings and you're going to see a lot of that here. Okay. Another one that's 79 cents and right up my alley with cute little earrings are these little frogs. Look at them. They're so cute. Cute. 79 cents fish hook earrings. Um, and they also have their little stoppers with them. Adorbs. Another cute pair of earrings. I saw them. I had to have them. I think I even ordered them again. Um, in my next haul. These donut earrings. So adorable fish hook. And so they would look, they would be like this. Good size. I really like them. Aren't they cute? And they're and they're lightweight, okay? They're not heavy. So so far I'm loving the cute earrings I got. Next thing is, I put it in this section, but I guess I could have gotten put it in the, the previous section. It's 89 cents, and it's a cute little retractable, like, ID holder. I have this type of ID uh, for work that I really needed a new holder. Um, and then you pull it, and it retracts. You clip this onto your like, I don't know, your pants or your, if you have something hanging, you can put it on your pocket on like up here. Um, and then look at the cute little bear. I really like this, the retractable. I really needed one and when I saw this, I was like, perfect. 89 cents, you're coming home with me. Moving on, we have another set of super cute little earrings. These were 79 cents as well. And look, <laughs> look how cute these are. Cracked eggs. <laughs> I thought they were so cute. I had to, I had to get them. Again, fish hook earrings and they have their little, um, stoppers. 
I call them stoppers. Like it's just backing, earring backings. That's what they really are. But I call them stoppers because I mean it helps the fish hook stop from coming out. So that's why I call it that. Okay. So another set of cute earrings, 71 cents. I thought they were, you know, really cute. Is cause it reminds me of like kind of like a little wreath. Um, but look how cute those are. Little crystals and faux pearls with the gold and the little bow. And uh these are just stud earrings. So I, I saw those. I thought they were so cute. And again, for 71 cents, not a bad deal. This is actually a set. It's 79 cents. I really liked it because it was, like I said, it was a set. Necklace and earrings. And... I like the design. Here are the earrings. Look at those. I'm pretty sure you've seen it when you're, you've been scrolling. Those, and even though they look like this, they're light, they're not heavy. So that's what I was concerned about. But if you see, look at the quality of the crystal. It's very nice because it really does sparkle. And it's supposed to be turquoise here. I think it might be like faux turquoise, but it's very, very pretty. And then the necklace is the same design. It does have an extender and that's the necklace. If I put it up to myself, see, that's the size. So really cute. I thought it was a good deal and the whole set for 79 cents. Really pretty. Very nice detail, very clean detail. Um, because always what concerns me about jewelry is if it's that inexpensive, the details on them tend to be sloppy. Do you know what I'm saying? Yeah. All right, next one is 71 cents. And I thought these were actually gonna be smaller and they're bigger than I thought, but the good thing is they're very light. So I'm not mad at that. So these are it. I keep trying to go to that side, I don't know why. So these are the earrings. So it's a big crescent moon with a little crescent moon and a star and a dangling there. I thought they were so cute with that detailing. So again, fish hook. And I'm sorry, I tend to be more of a silver tone. I prefer silver tone, so I might not show a lot of gold tone, but if you want me to, I can get them. I can always gift those away. Unless they're really cute, like those um, bow, pearl, and crystal earrings. I will wear those. Okay, this one's 79 cents and another moon type but it's a dangle earring so i thought these were were very neat and just for reference it would be like right there very simple but caught my eye and again so far the quality of jewel the jewelry they sell has been really good and I'm always concerned because the pricing is just so inexpensive. I'm surprised that they can get such good quality jewelry for the price that they have it for. Next thing is, I believe this is another set. This one's a dollar. Well, this one was a dollar with seven cents, 107. And I wanted, you know, speaking of gold, I wanted to incorporate a little bit more gold so you could take a look of the gold they have to offer or the gold tone they have to offer. And this one was a cute one to do that with. So this is a tree of life type of design. And these are the earrings. And oh, I lost one. So there's that. 
the detailing, fish hook, and if I were to put it up here, let's look at the size it is. Very, very nice size. And then this is a necklace with the little tree of life charm. It does have an extender already on, so that's that one. A good length of the chain too, so um, what's really nice is that they do include that extender portion, so in case you need to shorten or make it a little bit long, you have that option. 107, I thought that was a good deal for a set. Ooh, I really like these and I am so happy that they are good quality. They, are a, they were also a dollar with seven cents and sticking with the gold. Um, I really like these because I wanted to wear something um, a little bit, want to wear something a little bit more elevated for St. Patrick's Day. And I think these would be great. Look at the little crystals in it. Very good light uh, reflection and sparkle to them. So that means, you know, they're not such a flat crystal. It has a quite a bit of facets and gold tone with the green. I think that's perfect. And these are lever back, just FYI. These were lever back earrings. Next, one of y'all mentioned fidget rings. And when I went looking on the website, they didn't show me a lot, but they did show me this one. I got it for 39 cents. So there's this ring. So you put it on and then you can fidget with the little beads. See that? So if you're someone that likes to play with your, with your rings, with your jewelry, for me, if it's here, um, you can use this to be fidgeting and moving the little beads on there. And for 39 cents, I thought that was pretty neat because I do fidget with my rings. I'm always like spinning them, doing something and having this one where I can just be like spinning the little beads. That is actually pretty neat for me. It is, it is kind of, big it didn't let me choose the size um but i'll keep looking and if you see any fidget rings fidget like jewelry jewelry um send me the link i would love to see it you know if timu has that go ahead and send it to me okay, this is another ring for a dollar and 18 cents now a little bit pricier than i would usually get but i really like this design I normally am a seven. I got it in an eight so that I can put it like on my other finger. But look at that. It is so neat. So if I got an eight, I can put it in my pointer finger and look. It's pretty neat. Can I put it in my middle finger? Oh yeah. See that? It's not staying on because I really like it. Right, moving on. 71 cents for, and I like this to pair with the gold Tree of Life set, the earrings, the necklace. Look at this one. It's a bracelet, has the gold tone, and it has the little tree right here, the little dangle. It's stretchy, so this is, this is how it would fit me. It does stretch though. So it's good quality. Look at the little faceted beads there too. So 71 cents, I think would go great with that set together. Plus I love that pink, the pink tone of the beads. Next thing is a, this, I did a similar, I bought a similar set in the other haul. Uh, this one's 179. However, this one is, the theme is purple. It's five sets of earrings for $1.79. So here is, this is a purple theme. So these are the butterflies and see how they have kind of like a mother of pearl finish on them, but it's purple, lilac, little mushrooms, checkered heart, little 
duck. So we got the yellow ones. Now we have the purple and then the little clouds. And I believe I have the pink. Yeah, so I also have the pink set. And so it, come, it came with the pink clouds and I think the pink ducks. These over here were a little bit different and the butterflies were different, but yeah. Five pairs of earrings for $179. Not bad. We have three more jewelry pieces to look at. I really love this. This is a little bit pricier. It's $198 for the necklace. But I really, I'm, I was really hoping that this would be so pretty because it just looks so nice online. So the chain and the little charm, um, the pendant were separated, so I put them together. So this one does not have an extender, but again, you can always change up the chain if you want. But look how cute is this pendant. It's and I loved it because it reminds me of like my sister and myself, like BFFs, you know? Um, look how beautiful that round crystal in the background is. And then when you turn it around, it has little heart cutouts and you can see the crystal in there. I thought this was beautiful. For $198, I thought it was fantastic. All right, the last two jewelry pieces. This is $179 and it was the chakra bracelet. And these are really nice stone beads. See, I like this. I always, I've been wanting to get one of those. So this is neat. Um, great quality. Great, I think it's worth it. I've seen, I've gone to shops where they're much more expensive than that. Um, and this other one, 79 cents, it, it was supposed to be this chakra necklace. And the picture they showed online looked to be like this type of beads. So that's why I got it. But upon getting it, um, we're getting to the wish category here. I'm sad to say because this is not what I expected. So here's, you know, has a little extend and everything, and these are the beads. But look, look how, you know, I really thought it's, it looks, I'm sorry, Timu, but this one looks cheap. I expected this type of stone or, or bead like this see how it has like it's heftier and like I expected this type of bead on here because the picture they showed was that type of bead so I'll post it here so you can see it and so that was kind of disappointing yeah this is this is more of the wish type of thing. Again, this is the only time this has happened to me with Timu. So, I mean, hopefully it continues to be really good. And again, because of the pricing, I thought it was fantastic, but hopefully it doesn't go that way. Like wish. And the last category I have was some jewelry making supplies. Really, it's more like beads. Most of it, all, really all I have is like more like beads. So for this one is 89 cents for 10 of them, but there are these right here. So these, uh, the ones you saw last time had little fruits in them, like little slices of fruit, different types. These have little stars and they're all different, uh, different colors. And I think this is a better view. You see that different colors like that and I just think they would be so cute as little earrings or as a little necklace um so adorable and then I got the again 89 cents for 10 of them I got the blue star version of it like this uh my plan with this is I have some orange seed beads here 
and I want to make some earrings. So this would be the hanging portion and then some, you know, I don't know how I'm going to design it yet, but do the seed beads um, be part of like the rest of the earring and then this one hang down um, because those are my uh, work colors and whenever we have you know a function where you you're supposed to wear the colors or something I can wear those um, and talking about the seed beads uh, these were 89 cents for 450 pieces again they're seed beads so they're small like that and this is what I'm talking about using these this is 89 cents and then I also got the blue version 89 cents and then combine them somehow and incorporating this this one so I think that'll be fun to make earrings and potentially like a necklace bracelet type of thing I'm still thinking of you know ideas of how I'm gonna do that so that I can use them for work. Um, next up is another, um, so, yeah, so these were the orange and the blue. These are 89 cents as well, and I got a mixed color set. And again, 89 cents for 450. I know I can probably get really big bags of these. Um, maybe see that's the thing with I haven't found where I can buy like larger quantities at a good price in Timu so have you seen more like a wholesale part of Timu uh, let me know let me know where I can find that on the website um, because I know with AliExpress you can look more like a the like wholesale section and that's how where I've gotten like big bags of, uh, for example, crystals, like the little rhinestones. Let me see, I think I have some here. Like I get big bags and then I fill these up with my little crystals. And like, for example, these, I use them um, to make my decorations for my St. Patrick's tree when I switch it over. So I did this, like, these are the Dollar Tree little foam clovers. And then these are the crystals that I glue on. So I'm looking for more of that on Timu. I haven't been able to find it yet for good price. That's the thing, for a good price, like larger quantities of like beads and stuff. So if you found them, let me know. Okay, so the other thing I got, I got these for 89 cents. I have been eyeing them and I just really wanted some since last time. So these are them. These are the mixed color, 89 cents for these. I think these will also be super fine um, earrings because here where I'm at, we celebrate. If you've ever heard of Fiesta San Antonio, we celebrate that. And these are very much, you know, a lot of the colors we use which is what the wreath you see back there. I made that, I sell those. That one's already sold. I just need a few little touches, but we celebrate that that's a big thing. So I thought these would be great to make some earrings and sell them um, during that time. Last item I have are these other little beads. Uh, I also got them for 89 cents. It's a mixed color. But I like them because they had the silver, gold, and rose gold. Um, and then if you see, there's even an antique gold color. So I really like that combination. And I can, you know, I can find lots of ways where I can use these beads. And that was it. What are, you, what are your thoughts from Timu? What have you bought that you've been like, it's my favorite thing ever. Um, I highly recommend it. Drop those links below. Um, I was pleasantly surprised with uh, some of the kitchen items. Uh, I'm really curious of how this will work out once I do like ponytails and stuff. And um, FYI, my finger is still pink. And so is my hand. Um, 
and that was from the light version so I don't know how this will work out uh, but this will be fun I like having you know lip stains they as long here's the thing with lip stains you just need to make sure you really get it on your lips correctly so that you don't have like you know messed up color showing uh, another one of my favorite things were these sunglasses like very pleasantly surprised with these and wow like I'm right at the window as you can see <laughs> the reflection and you know you know how some sunglasses when you put them on it changes the color completely these don't like you have a good they're good I like these these are definitely gonna be used and I'm gonna go back and order some more uh let me know if you want to see me use these items like I said my plans for some of the beads is to create jewelry if you want to see me do that if you want to see me do a video of that just let me know I can definitely record it and post it here for just like a how-to and um I'm not like a super duper expert I just think it's, you know, I do a pretty decent job with them. Um, and then I will, um, and I can post that. Thank you. Thank you so much. Don't forget to subscribe. Hit that like button, the notifications, you know, so that you can see when I upload. I'm going to be trying to do um, some more Timu hauls, like little mini hauls. And, you know, trying to get those numbers up there. Thank you so much for the support. I've already hit one of my big marks, which is the hours. Uh, and it's all thanks to you guys because you're either sharing, you're commenting, you know, you're watching. And I really, truly do appreciate it. I know there's so many other creators that you could be, you know, watching and subscribing to. And, uh, you know, I'm blessed that you chose to subscribe to mine. And as we grow, I want, like I said, I want to make sure we, you know, we give back. So thank you so much. Really appreciate your time. And I hope you have a wonderful day. And as always, I will see you in the next one. Bye.